this guy's things coming up. I'm, I'll write this to the I'll read this to the guy because then I'll get out of this book. It's called No to a Holy Bad Man. Um, you know, you guys know what it's about. <laughs> he was a beautiful madness, a sharpened pen writing out messages against the dull and hazy LA skyline. I read him the first time in a makeshift squat on Hollywood Boulevard with a small votive candle to light up the pages. I read until the flame burned itself out. I would fall asleep dreaming about women who might beat me on the pool table but would still love me when I was down and out. He wrote about the ugly truth, the waste of talent gone unnoticed, the lack of talent that reaped reward, the perverseness of humanity, his own inequities, the coming and going of nothing, the futility and hope and hopelessness, the drive to keep a little balance, the necessity to save a little for yourself and to waste it on someone else for the hell of it, because no one else will. He defined the dual meaning of being a poor bastard so many different ways, each one I could relate to, each one felt personal. And he wrote it all down so you could read it drunk and insane and all alone. And the time passed a little less lonely. It was easy to underrate because he made it easy to understand. His greatest achievement, not in the universities or hallowed halls, but in the scrambled lives that linger below the poverty level and die there, from Skid Row to the Bowery and all points of bitter endings in between. Sometimes his words made me feel like the world was just a bunch of poor bastards, all of us the same, ripping ourselves to pieces just to be heard by somebody. Other times his words were warm and bitter, like a shot of cheap bourbon, but could still bring a smile. And, that, and somewhere in between all that, is where I like to picture him, the holy bad man, sitting in the middle of all the chaos and madness and yelling at all the lost souls, look, I don't know you. Will you just shut the hell up and get the fuck away from me? Mm -hmm. <laughs>